What up, ladies and gentlemen? How's it going? <laughs> yep, the whole world hears your annoying little mouth, huh? Dude, like I say, you've got over an hour before we feed you. Don't even start right now. How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Arguing with the cat here. Yeah? It's time for some Outer Wilds, yo. We go on exploring today. Alright. Alright, go, go, go. I'm chasing that down today. Let's see how far we can get. That's not it, I'm not the star that I'm foolishly chasing. suck. Go lay down. You've got an hour. In ten minutes. Twelve minutes. Really? <laughs> oh, kitty. Can't tell if the gauge in the bottom right is actually moving. I think so. I don't think any of the gauges change. Way to look around that. Oh, scalped way too far away to even get a tire. I think I'm chasing the right thing. Oh crap. Do I see it at least? Darn it. Ooh. No, I honestly can't tell. I'm actually getting closer to these other stars. They look three dimensional. It's only a certain draw distance, so if I don't, I'm not in range. Alright, let's reset this loop and try again. 
So I'm gonna go after that again. Actually, no. <clears throat> I'll reset the loop and I actually do it. Let's go. <clears throat> Dude, really? Just leaning right against me on the ba my back. <gasps> Straight through the planet. Anyways, uh, let's get in the ship and figure out what I'm doing. See what puzzle we're gonna solve today. Okay, ooh, we found the gravity cannon, the frozen Nomi shuttle, subsurface energy readings. Ah, yeah. That's from the Rico. Do you really? Okay. Get down. Gotta push up against me. Your butt. Anyways. Somewhere in the dark room where you Which is a big escape pod. Torres. It's the sun station. Oh, it's high energy lab. Twins North Pole. All right, let's do that one. Let's put it on. Hey guys, uh, let's put a hollow. Looking very close to the variable interloper. Is uh, the deep? There we go. Amber Twin North, right? Go for the star, please. I said no. <laughs> uh. Oh, it automatically targets the sun for me. So, I'm a crack shot. Nope.
Let's see what happens if I follow this all the way. I think it's got a little bit of a stabilizing spin now. Very gentle, and I think it's about it. Flying at about six, only 655 meters a second. It's not that fast, but given the time we're gonna get. Exactly. <sighs> I'm slightly disappointed. That I can't get in it. That would be cool.
Whoop. Hmm. Hi. So. Hey. You don't have a frequency. It's not one that I know of yet. I'm pretty sure if I was this close, I'd get up. All right. Well. Yes. Still quite a bit of exploring to go. I haven't touched that at all. <laughs> In between the North Pole is where I want to go next time. Quantum Moon, the sixth mysterious location. Slime shuttle. And the Quantum Shine. The Room of Quantum Entanglement. <laughs> Of an observatory, a brittle hollow, which I can't. Yeah, towards the surface, but it's broken. Uh, there's more to explore. Ryback's camp, apparently. Union City, there's more to explore. Black Forge. Sixth location, the shrine must be on the moon's north pole. And quantum shards. There's no way I can... Oh, I was lying to me. Yeah. Probably not gonna go there for a while. Gabo and the quantum signal. The giant's deep. Then there's the dark ramble. Just reading this on quest. The white hole station. And then the interloper. Official gravity. I don't know where you're supposed to be. Five hundred nineteen kilometers away. Oh, we do have a map. Yeah. Not much long left on this sun, but it looks if it looks like the sun station's already gone. 
And the interloper is scheduled to meet its maker next round. I think it's on its last descent or ascent. Of Harry Lopian. Do we really have a name for the sun? It's just called Sun, I believe. It doesn't take it too far out. gauges I think change. Even rotating is imparting me momentum. That is amazing. <laughs> How's the sun doing? Oh, he's getting red. The antelope is on his way back now. Antelope never intersects with uh, Giant Steep, does it? That's looking close. Might fall behind though. Yeah, that sun is getting pretty hot. Keep forgetting about that. <laughs> Um, for sure. 
The interloper in Giant Steep. Just made a child. Maybe it's actually in there. Ah. Yeah, the interloper crashed into Giant's Deep. And the sun is shaky. See everything shaky. See it? Shaky. safe out here? I don't think so. I think I'm just gonna get eaten. Music kicking in. Time is almost up. <laughs> I love how the uh, interloper's orbit path is still there, but it's still. Oh! And it just registered. Oh no, it's still there. Registering there. Fifty kilometers away now. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, this has been a weird one. Hello, the antelope is back. Wait. And it goes down it's deep. Obliterated dark bramble gone. And we fade to the Okay. So I'm curious if we're tower timely. If it's on, hmm. we'll figure that out. I'm sure. All right. Yeah, we. Wait, well, that was kind of what? All right, cut. Doom. That goes. Let's actually get some exploration done here, shall we? 
So we're going to M the Twins North Moon. Not burning up in the sun this time. Alright. See sun. Yes, that's the brittle place. Where's the sun? Right below us today, isn't it? Hey quantum moon, bye quantum moon. There is the sun. And there you guys are, you're on this side of the orbit. enough to the North Pole to do this. is definitely getting in here now. Oh gosh. Oh, that's not nice. 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 <laughs> Boy, that didn't take long. Oh, that one hurt. Oh, okay. So we're ignoring that one now.
to you. Let's go Ash. God! <laughs> well, how's it going? Fresh air. Uh. Pretty cheap. Uh. Right. And go. Oh gosh. Woo hi. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. Uh, come on. Stay down. Okay. Well, Parker here for the. Got a suit on. Good, good. Okay. up to on the south pole. You look like you're the first to really start showing yourself. Hi 
છે Definitely not made for re-entry. Hi, Antelope. Let's, uh... Let's use our unlimited fuel just to hop around for now. Here we go. We'll basically do the slow and arduous. Wait until it's clear. Alright, we are fueled, oxygenated, and healed. Here we go. Oh, this door's broken. Alright, well, we'll keep following this trail. Oh, no, we won't. Oh, no, we won't. Oh, no, we won't. to read it. It's quite dangerous. Yeah, that, oh. Is that weird? I don't know, I think that's the sun pulling on me there. That was scary. Little purple. Oh, yeah, we definitely got a room here coming up. Oh, this is just a lower level. Okay. Coming up, but I can read scrolls, so. Still, you're still connected. Just don't really to see it. Oh, that's not good. That's certainly not good. Aha! You do warp. <gasps> Oh, 
14 minutes until end of cycle. Probe track and module giant steep memory and temp Yeah. 8 minutes, 5 seconds. Oh gosh. Today we finished the excavation of the Ash Twin here in the space we carved. We will craft the most ambitious project yet. We asked my project partner enough to send information back in time. Let's finish relocating all subterranean plants we met while digging. Oh, plants. We need to keep our eyes on the We've altered the environment here. This was not by accident. The core of our water was the last to be forged. Of course, could have been forged faster if Cassava had interrupted my work less frequently to ask for updates. Sure. The important point is we are all connected for the Ash Twin now, and also that I'm no longer needed for meditating and mediating your disagreements. The friends on Jandy tested the robot program today. Another test with Ken is doing well. Not ad it's advocates. Yes, Maximum power of the habits getting it. <laughs> then if anyone can go to device into exploding, that too is like Evans. Perhaps I should check in with the orbital probe panel and crew in the interest of our safety. Of safety. Would it help to remind Avens that Mallow his love would be the one of the Naomi aboard the cannon? Or is Mallow part of the problem? Flaws and Des finished the memory statues to the end, they are truly remarkable. When the Ashton product succeeds, or the event fails, the memory statues will activate allowing us to gather more data before we shut down the project. I and I there have worked hard on the sun station at last it is, it is at last complete. If everything goes as planned, the structure will prompt the sun's explosion. Which will then in turn supply the power. Supply the power the Ashton project requires. I'm impressed by their mental fortitude. This was the project's most difficult task in one way some one. When they'll ready to activate the Ash Twin project, here's what will happen. First, the Sun Station will receive the order to fire up the sun, prompting it to explode. Using the energy from the resulting supernova, the Ash Twin project will send the order from the orbital probe cannon to fire back in time by 20. In fact, 22 minutes after these orders are received, the Sun Station will again trigger the supernova to send the probe data from this cannon launch in time. The total each cycle created by the S2 project will last precisely 22 minutes, and at this cycle it will. These words are difficult to write. The sun station did not work. However, this is the closest we have ever been. The Eastern Project is theoretically sound. We were only unable to power it. Perhaps there is another way. Suppose we would design the sun station to generate power out of that magnitude. A supernova is still our only viable option. I believe we can still find a way to create a supernova, my friend. Don't lose hope. It is easily expressed and accomplished. You can wait for the sun to explode on its natural timeline if you prefer a day up, but you'll need to find some way to halt our aging process. We are halting our research into creating a supernova for the moment. A comet has newly arrived in the solar system and we are anxious to explore it. It's been a very long time since we last explored somewhere new, so we're excited to welcome this comet. Imagine what it's might negate there. You are not active. You're about to access the core while Ash Trin is active. Removing the core would disable the Ash Trin project. Uh, 
artificial gravity. Uh, was what was imparting momentum. Oh, that's beautiful. Do I really want to do this? I don't know if I have the information to do this. A black hole and a white hole in there. I'm not gonna do it. I don't wanna do it yet. I've installed the mask inside the Astrian Project Flux. They do look they look beautiful, although I do feel as though I'm being observed. It's comforting to notice that she's not prayer until the project succeeds. Otherwise I imagine the experience would be hard to endure. Ideally they only need to activate once the project succeeds as a safety measure. However, these such walls are to prevent of equipment failure. Well they why is that? If anything goes wrong with the Astrian Project, the statues of the mask will make us aware of the situation and enable us to fix it. Otherwise it would be possible for us to remain potentially aware of the problem. I hadn't thought of that. What a profoundly horrific fate that would be. I have exciting news, Privet. The Ash Twin Project is almost prepared to receive the probe data from the Orbital Probe Cannon. Rami is adding some finishing touches here, but she'll be finished soon. Are you in the Orbital Probe Cannon well? We are. The probe tracking module is ready to record each launch's flight trajectory and will automatically transmit all relevant data to you. Once the probe determines the location of the Eye of the Universe, I'll send you an alert directly to you and Raimi. And the other appendage, I know. I'm now worried about this cannon structure and integrity and its crew's moral integrity. I have good news, Yaro. The advanced warp core is ready to be installed at the heart of the Ash Twin project. I'm intrigued, love. Everyone on Ash Twin is excited to see it. High is beside herself with joy. No, it isn't. Is everything well at the forge? Don't worry, love. Poke is only nervous. The core is extraordinary, and her design work is beautifully clever. The core's durability should still be could still be improved. I need more time. Ignore her, Yaro. The core is finished, and if my sister tells you otherwise, then she will be finished as well. Am um, I got to shoot for the latest shipment, O'Neill? Oh, this ore should be the last ore we'll need for the Ashtrim project. Once we've finished the sh shell that seals off the core, we'll check to ensure that there are no longer any physical entrances. Remy and I will be checking the exterior and the interior and exterior for cracks. Our final safety check. Six acting news. Can I offer my extra set of eyes for this final check, specifically mine? If my work here is complete, I'd be delighted to help. We'd be grateful if you would. The more eyes, the better. As the smallest floor opening in the shell that protects the core could lead to disaster. Interesting. Now oh, I was busy reading those. Hi. Why aren't you paired?
Okay, so projection stone is like a projection. This is just beautiful. Hold on. How are we doing? Oh. We've already lost a few things. Uh, probe truck and motor. Alright. Carry this all the way back. Yep. Come on, Giant's Deep. I want to watch. Hey, it's home. What can I see about my home planet? Very dark on one side. Six minutes. Let's see. 
doesn't fully stop, this should probably just slow down. Yeah. Interesting to figure out who owned what. There's my timer. Three minutes. All right. So end of cycle transmission. Oh my god, I put something in orbit. Until end of cycle. Two minutes. This part certainly isn't like a minute long. Uh. Ladies and gentlemen, I totally stumbled upon everything. Really. because I have to fire it crooked. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, you're gonna clap that. Zero minutes until end of cycle transmission. Does that allow me to go back in time?
does that allow me to go back in time? Oh my gosh. I don't want to try that. Mm -hmm. Oh man. That was my last cycle. Jesus! <laughs> oh man. Well, gee, y'all. That was knocking foots. Man. Oh man. That was my last cycle. Jesus! <laughs>